Oh my gilly goodness. how cold I am how cold are you tell me how cold you are tell me how cold you are fucking tell me hello hello everyone it's so cold is it snowing it, has anyone got snow I think I saw um 
Elbow Baggins say that there was snow. Are you toasty? Thank you for joining the Discord. Yay. Um, we'll talk about Discord in a second. Um, it is really, actually, it's really quite warm in this office. But the problem I have is that when I go into the house to make lunch, the house, we don't have the heating on during the day or anything. So the house is really cold. Oh my gilly goodness. And so I go into the house and I get... Unusual join activity detected in Nad's Discord. It's fine. It's fine. I think that's fine. Thank you for joining, everybody. Oh, do I have to mute it? <laughs> Good. Cool. Uh, is that done it? Maybe somebody else should join. Maybe somebody else could join to see to see if I've if I've muted it. Somebody just did something. Hasn't hasn't muted. Uh, oh my how do I mute Discord? I thought. Uh, here we go. Where's Discord? Discord. Monitor only mute output. Okay. Remember. I could turn on streamer mode. I turned off streamer mode. Next time I play a game with somebody and I'm on voice chat, we'll have to remember to turn that on. Um, is it gone now? Has it gone now? How do I turn streamer mode on? Is it still blooping? I've turned it on to mute only. Oh, do you know why? Because I've got it open on my, um, I've got it open on browser as well, because I was going to have a quick look at it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I've got it open as in a, in a Chrome tab as well. I was going to have a quick look at it. Although I can't, like, there's a lot of people who will be like, there's a lot of you who are going to be enthusiastic and excited, and that's really lovely. And there's a lot of people that will join and get involved. Um, there's some people who are like, yeah, okay, I, I, I like ad. Um, I'll join the Discord because there'll be sometimes I want to post stuff and there'll be a shitload of people who don't give a fuck. And a lot of people will be like, don't talk about Discord for ages. I don't care. I don't want to join. Um, screw you. If you're one of those people, screw you. Don't rain on my parade. It's my, it's my party. I've waited so long. Some people start streaming. Boom, Discord. I waited 18 months. I waited until I was partner, mostly because I had Pip's Discord to use. Um, that is the main reason but I waited until I was partner and now we're here it's 18 months and it's very exciting Pip's Discord is still the one I'll probably be in the most chatting in I like getting in Cudder's Discord uh, I like Booch's Discord I like Wasps' Discord uh Am I missing out? I still haven't joined TAFs. I feel like I need to, but I feel like I never see oh anything that says, goodness. join, here you go, please join Discord. Anyway, are you still getting alerts? Are you still getting alerts? Thank you, Emily. No alerts. Okay, thank you. All right, I'll, I'll turn on streamer mode again. In fact, do I just turn off? Oh, it doesn't matter. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. Mary Biscuits, welcome in. Thank you very much. Uh, Mary Biscuits, Sparkle Muffin, Llama. I'm already in a folder. Llama has already stuck me in a folder, by the way. Um, I think. I don't know that for sure, but I think we can guess. Um, Guzbo and Wasps are all mods in the Discord too. Also, Please if you've joined the Discord... Hello, yes. Div. Thank you so much for the bits. How have we got a hype train? Oh, shit. Look, all these resubs. Wow, my activity feed. Look, my activity feed's all the way over there. It's too far away. Thank you very much for the resubs. Funkle Albert, 19 months of my life was an empty void. Sorry, 19 months ago, my life was an empty void. Can confirm, actually. Um, I had to start streaming to save, to save Funkle. Thank you, Funkle Albert, for that. Prox plays stuff. Hello. I haven't seen you for ages. Mine too, Funkle Albert, me old mucker. Finally, the Prox has come. Finally, the Prox has come back to add, add, add. Um... 
You've also subscribed for 19 months, even though you haven't been here, Prox. Thank you. That's really nice. Thank you. Prox used to listen to the wrestling podcast that um, I used to do. Please accept this sexy gift. OBX, thank you very much for the resub as well. Six months. Very kind of you. Um, I hope you're well. Elbow Baggins, you have snow. Can't see any snow. This morning, I checked. I was like, how cold is it? Before I'd opened the curtains or the blinds and I checked the weather and it said snow forecast for the next two hours and it had the thing. Oh, I nearly just showed my weather app, which would have showed my exact location. Um, I had the thing where the app was showing snowing. Please accept I was like, fuck, gift. this is amazing. And I turned to Alex, who's my daughter, and I said, apparently there's going to be snow. Might even be snowing now. Open up the blinds. No snow. Just grey. I made a mistake there. I shouldn't have said anything because then she was upset. But I think if the app says it's snowing, then it actually should be snowing. Uh, but we've had nothing. Now it's raining, which means I'm worried that girls football is going to be cancelled, which means that I'd have to leave an hour earlier. But hopefully that won't happen. But anyway, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Elbow, I'm glad that you've had snow. H how was your dog walk in the snow? I hope the dog, the dogs like go like that. <laughs> I've seen dogs in snow. I don't know why I'm asking. Les Dennis, when did you last fart in a bath? Every time I bath. Uh, when's the last time I had a bath? Three weeks ago? I probably have a bath every once every two or three months, something like that. Thank you very much, Div, for the bits. Thank you, Willow, for the bits. And thank you, Div, for extra bits. So yeah, it's Discord day. So um, I've got a Discord. Loads of you have joined. Some of you will see, oh, what's this on the right? Best mates. Oh, Funkle Albert is in the best mates. Um, you're all going to be best mates. Funkle Albert's no, no more special than any of you. So let's, let's do some signing right now. Uh, which means the audio will come back on. Hold on, let me actually, so you can't see all my DMs. <gasps> right, you're going to get some alerts now, but it'll be fine because it's in context. This is the unusual activities that loads of people have joined. I think. Taff, Taff, I, if you join my Discord today, I'm joining your Discord today. I need, I was just saying, I've been thinking for the, like the last month I want to join Taff's Discord, but I haven't seen a link and I haven't asked for a link. But I should definitely be in Taff's, especially because I want to do this walking podcast review thing. Weezy, I wondered what the double zero was. I thought that was your attempt at eyes. Um, <clears throat> hold on I've just been sent a, a link to Taf's Discord Big Taf server join check out our rules say hello nah I'm going to check it I will check out the rules look at this it's all really pro <gasps> it's got graphics <gasps> emotes I'm going to rip this off no I'm not I'm not I'm not I'm not, I'm not. Um, anyway thank you very much um, I don't know how much we're going to do in here. And in fact, you can't even see the, the sidebar. How do you see the sidebar with the rolls and things? I don't really know what I'm doing and what I should show you and what I shouldn't show you. So let me just go into server settings. Let me go to roles. Let me go to best mates. And let me go to manage members. You're all going to be best mates. It's not just Funkle Albert. It's just I invited Funkle Albert last night just to test it got me you've got the mods you've got everyone else you've got one solo bot and then the at, the at everyone command has to have its own thing so if you guys are cool with this buckles is a mod best mate best mate best mate best mate sorry mods you're not my best mates you just no no you're more no whatever Best mate, best mate, best mate. Thank you, everybody, for joining. Best mate, best mate. Mod, mod, mod. Best mate. Best mate, best mate. Best mate, best mate. Best mate. I've got more best mates than I thought I would. Best mate. I don't recognise this name at all. Um, and there's no picture. But it could be somebody that just lurks in the stream all the time. So we're going we're gonna to go for best mate. 
We're going to go for best mate, but if you're here in the stream, please say hello. Please say hello. That's you, Fluffernutter. Okay. <laughs> Just, a, I was a bit, I was a bit confused. Um, let me catch up with a little bit more of the chat, by the way. Hello, sheep. Hello, Chris. Hello, Adasaurus. How are you? Uh, everyone's talking about being toasty. That shows how far away I am. Uh, da, da, da. Let's actually do some proper catching up. Definitely know how to mod Discord. Yeah, uh, I thought about that. Honestly, I don't want you lot to think that you've got to do any work in there. But I think Llama and maybe Mary no, and maybe Gus, but I don't know. Maybe maybe everyone except for you wasps and me know how to like ban people or if we get any weird activity. But you you don't have to do anything. I just thought I'd give you a role in the Discord. Uh, hello, Fluffy. Hello, Les. I'm going to catch up. Sorry if I've been talking through sound alerts. I didn't hear them. Keep it at the top. Taff, I'm definitely, I'm definitely going to be coming into your uh, Discord a lot. You can do auto rules. Rolls. Yes, I need to know. I need to know how you can do that. But for now, we're just going to do some clicking. And also, this is special. This is like getting a first badge. Everyone else is just going to get it auto. This is really special, okay? Just in case you're wondering if it's special or not. Fluffernutter, you're here though. Look, Fluffernutter, is this you as well? Best mate, best mate, best mate, best mate. Hello, John. I thought you said this was you. Am I getting confused? Oh my god, imagine if I actually did make you all mods by accident. You're not this person. So sorry. So who's this? I don't know if I want to add them as my best mate. This one's confusing to me. So we'll just keep a little eye. We'll keep a little eye. But if that's you, then let me know. What? Fluffer! What's happening? Sorry, it's because you said you are not Dubra Master. The problem is... Yeah. So, so hold on. This is you. Then who's this? You have no idea who this is. Hmm. <laughs> hey, I'll take it. I'll take it. Hello, Llama. I swear you're not trolling. I said, no, it's fine. It's fine. I don't think you are. I think we're just confused, which is fine. Um, how, how do we add auto rolls? We'll do this another time. Don't worry. We're not going to, we're not going to do uh, somebody else trolling. I blame Pip with all his talk of stealing names. So yeah, I know. Pip was just chaotic yesterday. Uh, I was I was lurking in the start of that stream for quite a while. Is this some sort of secret best mates area? Basically, if you join the Discord, you're automatically going to be a best mate. Well, not automatically at the minute I have to add you. When I started to set up, set up the Discord last night, I was like, oh, this is easy. I just select categories and just add like things like channels. This is going to be cool. And then I was like, oh, no, shit, what about mods? And how do you get it so that you get the little animations of people waving to each other? And how do you select different roles? And what about security? Anyway, I watched a few YouTube videos, but I haven't worked out how to auto add. But anyway, you lot, best mates. Right now, apparently there's 12 best mates online. Um, I'm going to work that out later. If you're not a best mate now, now I'll... I'll work it out later, okay? And I'll and I'll add you. you know, it's going to be so cool. But there's already 24 people in. Thank you. And I totally get it if you don't want to join. Uh, Llama didn't want to join, but had to join. But if anybody else doesn't want to do it, fair enough. But just really quickly, while we're here, before we get into the other stuff, I promise I'm not going to do this all the time. Here's what you can do. We've got chit chats. You can come and have general chat about anything where you're like, hey, how you doing? How's your morning? And somebody else is like, oh, my morning's not great. And then somebody else says, are you okay, hun? And the other person says, uh, no, but I don't really want to talk about it. The old Facebook stuff. 
we do a lot of that kind of stuff here would be great pick some memes obvious music film and tv podcast food mental health fitness sport i thought about mental health actually no it is good it is good i was going to try and split it down into different stuff um but no it's, we'll just have that there because sometimes people just want to come and and just say how they're doing my stream live alert i set this up so it works the bot will tell people when i'm live in here so that's cool that's still happening in pips maybe i feel cheeky now and i'll say to pip don't worry about it you can remove it this is for clips or screen grabs i put i found an old photo of uh of a freezer redeem there is a secret mod chat uh but that moderator only is just where stuff goes Slothy, I've just seen a picture of you, your Discord picture. You look quite a lot like my cousin. Um, that's where, like, if there are people who are banned or reported, it will go into there. Um, this is the old Freezer Redeem. Uh, God, emotional. But you can come and talk about the crossword, how you've got on with that. Rate your lunch submissions can come in here now so we're not spamming um, Pip's Discord. If you want to still do it in Pip's Discord, you can. But um, this is where you can put your submissions, any uh, controversy about Property Guesser. Oi! And then this is a link to my YouTube, but also any new YouTube videos will automatically get posted into here. So you can see when I've uploaded uh, an old VOD. Game suggestions, up for that. Um... Sorry, I've completely forgotten my friend who I used to work with. He messaged me earlier, a game idea, and now I've forgotten what he's called on Twitch. Fluff and utter. It's fine. It is absolutely fine. Um, game suggestions are good. <clears throat> I sometimes feel like asking that in Pip's chat, but it's like I'm, I'm happy here. If they're games that you think would be good for me to play, you, a lot of you have been around for a long time will now know. The bloop noise is awful. Well, people keep joining. Okay, take, tell you what. Should I just mute the browser? I've muted the browser, so you won't get that for a bit. I actually quite, I find the uh, bloop noise is quite comforting, but I don't have my headphones on. So suggesting game ideas is good for me. You know the kind of games that I would like. Don't email me and being like, I've got this massive multiplayer online RPG game with huge numbers of skill trees and you have to RP as an orc. And I think it's up your street ad. Uh, no. Uh, these are the games that I keep coming back to that we can talk about. Shersha stuff, what I thought would be cool is to have all of the previous old Shersha stuffs. Uh, this is just for general stuff and to make suggestions. I've linked to all the videos of all the old Shersha stuffs and then also if you want and look at this it's already happening you can send stuff that maybe you sent me originally or you found since i haven't even read any of this um look gusbo added some stuff last night in retro tech and look mary biscuits has already shared um the photo album of all their comics and there were so many that was a great episode and you can go and watch me singing at the start of the last school one and then promo, anybody who's doing a stream, come and promo. Wasps did it this morning at nine when there was only five people in the Discord. Um, charity stuff, if you're doing anything for charity, you work for a charity, you want to recommend a charity, a charity has helped you, whatever it may be, charity stuff in here. Work stuff, there was some confusion about what this is, but this is for people to talk about their work if they've got something they want to promote um, that their work's doing or there's a job that they've heard of. Um They've released something, I don't know, for example, for Pod Bible, I might say when the new Pod Bible's out or whatever. And then we've got voice channels. Anyway, wow, I'm bored. I'm actually bored of that. So thank you, everybody who's joined. And the Discord command will be there and occasionally people will get reminded. And that's all we're going to talk about. No, we're not going to talk about it anymore. We're definitely going to talk about it at times. I promise not to talk about it for longer than a minute I'm trying not to lie. I'm trying not to lie. Uh, it'll probably get talked about quite a lot until until I, I'm not excited anymore. Anyway, let me catch up. Sorry about all the bloops. Thank you for joining, everybody. Um, 
you think you, I, I'd make a great, great orc? Thank you, Mino. Yes, Willow, definitely get in the charity bit. Please share. All, uh, if you, well, I follow Willow on Instagram, and Willow shares a lot of good shit. Stuff that um, they're working on, but also just really nice things. The other day, there's a charity that I think Willow is helping out with. In fact, share the link if you want, Willow. Um, where you can send, is it a letter or is it a gift or is it both? I think it might be a, a letter. You can send um, like a letter to like a really like ill, seriously ill children or their parents or their carers or whatever it may be. Maybe it's a gift. You've probably already filled this in and let us know. Um, but share that, Willow. It looked great. And I've been meaning to do it. I didn't email them, but I'm going to do it. We're only ever going to talk about the Discord. It's because I know you hate it so much, Llama. Um, I'd love to drill down into why Llama doesn't enjoy Discord. Loads of chat rooms. I do get it, though. When you're in loads of discords and you've got loads of different alerts. Taft's discord is great. Look at that. Look at this. Look at this design. I just, I just shoved the discord icon in the ball that I'm holding in my profile picture, which doesn't look like me anymore because I've got hair and I'm not wearing glasses. Look at big Taft man's. Look at all this. Anyway, welcome everybody who's here. Stop talking about Discord. Hey, 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 hey. You think you'll actually use this one? Yes, Mary. That's the thing. I, th I feel like, yeah, 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 yeah. Obviously, I'm excited about it. Did I see Pip just posted something in here? Great. I don't even know if you can see that. Is this, uh, there we go. Great. Thanks, guys. Thanks, C. Um, but yeah, Pip, please feel free. I, I, I don't even know if you know how to do this, so maybe it would be Llama. Um, but you can remove the alert for when I go live in your channel now. If you want, I feel it feels a bit cheeky having that as well now that I've got my own thing. Uh, anyway, so there you go. New Discord. Yay. Willow says, yes, thanks, Ad. You can do emails, letters or gifts, whatever suits you. Post pals, they're gorgeous people. There you go. Fuck Spotify, but I still want to see ad stats. Yeah, VT, I did. I've tr I tried to listen to a lot more music this year. I got my podcast stats, and actually I listened to my podcast via um, Pocket Cast, so I'm waiting for them to do their, their stats on there. My Spotify, all I'll tell you is that my genres were rock, fifth wave emo, indie rock, Crank wave and alternative emo. I'm just an emotional guy. Um, crank wave. I don't know what that is. Yes, VT. Should we find out what crank wave is? Sounds kind of saucy, doesn't it? Or well, not saucy. It sounds like some sort of horrid thing that you do as a teenager. Crank wave. In the late 2010s, early 2000s, a new wave of post-punk bands, mainly from Britain and Ireland, emerged. Britain and Ireland? I don't think I've been listening to any British and Irish post-punk bands. You're cranking and waving now. Always knew I was an emo kid. I used to get so emo. I used to listen to so much music about like having girlfriends and breaking up with girlfriends before I ever had a girlfriend or broke up with a broke up with a girlfriend. And I'd get so, I'd be like, fucking yeah, man. I know, I know, I feel this. <laughs> I don't feel it at all. I wish I could feel it. I'd love it. Desperate to be heartbroken. I think I might have heard Pip talk about that before. This is not path of theft. 
There's a lot of guys like us, okay? Sensitive guys who just wanted to love and be loved. For some reason, it didn't happen. Um, so yeah, that's the main excitement is the uh, Discord. That's the main excitement for me and the, and the things that we can achieve together <laughs> in there. Um, I've been seeing a lot of people playing Lethal Company. I saw obviously Cudder and Taff were playing Lethal Company last night. Wasps was playing it this morning with um, Taff again and Barmer uh, and Mac. I haven't watched any of it. I've had the streams open. I had, I had Wasp stream open and last night I had the two streams open, but I'm sort of glancing over. Um, I haven't been watching any of the gameplay because I feel like for some reason I just want to go in completely fresh and I am going to play it at some point. Uh, it's only £8.50. It's the game of the summer. Everybody's talking about it. Everybody's playing it. It sounds really fun. There are a few times when I was, because I was playing poker. I, did, I played a bit of poker last night with Cade and Guzbo and Paige and Div and Sparkles and Gastronaut and Llama and I shouldn't start listing people because then I forget who who else was, wasn't there was there um, but I had the, I had Taff and uh, Cutter streams open and there were a lot of times when I glanced over and Taff was creasing up and Cudder was looking mortified so any game that makes those two things happen sounds like a good game but I might play it Monday night because Pip, I think Pip said that he can't do Mace Murder Monday on Monday night now. Uh, so maybe on my Monday night stream, I might give that a go. I'd be Pipless. Lethal Company and Tarkov era is here. Oh, God. Although it looks like a lot of people are going to play Tarkov. I'm not against Tarkov. I just need to watch it a bit more uh, to sort of get to grips. Taff was doing a good job of explaining it the other day. Anyway, I've also been recommended a point-and-click adventure game, which I've, I don't think I've really ever played them. A new one that's come out. It's like a horror adventure point-and-click thing um, by Die Tie Fighter. So I'm going to maybe look at doing that. But today, because I know that Rust is kind of coming to a natural end and that other games are going to come back on the table, part of me is like, ah, snooker, fuck. But I'm in the semi-finals with Scotty Two Potty, and in very a very short amount of time, Scotty Two Potty is going to have his own hotty potty to sell because we're getting Scotty Two Potty hotty potty merch, and I've looked into that. I've thought about looking into that, and uh, I might Google it because Mary and Lama said it definitely wouldn't happen, even if I buy a hotty hot water bottle, and I use a sharpie to write scotty two potty on it we're gonna get a scotty two potty hotty potty but scotty two potty yes llama scotty two potty who had a hotty potty last night and who called it a hotty potty was it just me i didn't have one last night i don't actually own one um okay must be professionally made okay i'll dm mary do you do you have room for another commission Yoda your dinosaur, Llama, did you call it a hotty botty? Of course you didn't. You're going to say no, fuck off, no I didn't. You'll say something like that because then you'd remain in character but you can DM me uh, privately and tell me that you called it a hotty botty. Um, anybody else? Has, has anybody else had or made a hot water bottle for anybody and called it a hotty botty? Because this is taking off, honestly. I've seen it trending. Um, I've seen it trending. There's no bottle in it. Oh, of course, it's your microwave bean thing. Um, I can see that Willow and Taff are promoting some charity stuff in the Discord, so that's exciting. So go and have a little look. I'm getting the little pop-ups. Your one of your brothers calls it HWB. That's that's longer than a, no uh, HWB hot water bottle. Five syllables. Both five syllables. So it means HWB is stupid because if they're ever communicating with anybody else and they say, oh, can you get my HWB? They'll go, what? And then they'll have to say hot water bottle. Slothy, get them to say hotty botty. Just get them to say hotty botty. 
Um, yeah, so uh, uh, this was all what my uh, snooker. So I'm going to play snooker. I think we're in the semi final. I think I might even be three nil down in the semi final of the World Championships, and it's the last ever match I'm going to play, um, win or lose. Um, last ever tournament I'm going to play is Scotty Two Potty, uh, and we've got a little video that shows. In fact, let's just play it right now. Turn it up. Hotty Wotty Botty is too much, Blaketown. That is so silly. Um, I need to stop these Discord things coming up. I'm getting lots of pop-ups. Maybe that's because I've got a new Discord server and I haven't turned off notifications. There's lots, look, there's lots I haven't done. But thanks for joining. If you've joined and you're like, why aren't I a best mate? You will be. I'll add you as a best mate and everybody will auto be added as a best mate. Um... Let's just do the crossword. Do you remember the other day when I did the crossword? I'm going to do it again now. And we play, and we play, and we play, and we play, and we play. Every day, every day, every day, every day. We're going to do the crossword, crossword. We're going to do the crossword, crossword. We're going to do the crossword, crossword. We're gonna do the crossword, the crossword, the crossword, the crossword, the crossword, the Shut up. No, it hasn't. Um... Loads of other chat about other stuff in the middle of the Discord Oi. chat. Don't rain on my parade if I'm excited about something. Humph. <sighs> oh my god there's there's a message in the football chat saying they've only got 13 players tonight and I'm not playing because I'm supposed to be going out for a drink and then a curry with some of the school dads which is going to be good but oh my god the temptation to cancel and go and play football instead is huge think about what that's it's doing to my body Probably a couple of beers and a curry compared to an hour of running around playing football. But it's good to be social and do stuff. This is, we never do this. This is the first time we've done it. There's, there's, a, there's a few dads that I say hello to on the drop-off and then one of them suggested this and now we're doing it. Um, it'll be good. No chance of two in a row. <sighs> I think I did four in a row once. I don't, should we just say that? Should we say that's what happened? I think I've done four in a row. I'd love to play football though. Okay. Get your bets in. Oh, you've got one second. Oh my Capriso. goodness. Thank you, Capriso. How are you? BT always believes, which I really appreciate. And still has Pats to bet, so it can't be going that badly. Um, all right, I'm going to freeze the chat. And I'm going to freeze it. I like when Pip did this the other day. Um, Pip actually did it fully and typed a letter in straight away. So the timer starts. And that's what we're going to do now. Why does that say canvas box? Okay. Ready. Um, I was about to freeze the chat properly. A group of lads going out on the lash who are only have in common that they ejaculated within a 12-month period. True. And probably within a 12-mile radius. All right. Let's freeze the chat. Uh, okay, let's put a letter in here and then let's go. Law Enforcement Agency. Uh, there's loads, so we'll wait. Lead member of COVID-19 Task Force in America. I don't know. Over here, was it Professor Jonathan Van Tam? Was it Dr. Chris Whitty? I don't know the other one. Pungent. Smelly. S-M-E-L. No. Smell. Is it just smell? Shore birds. What birds do you get on a shore? Seagulls. Gulls. G-U-L-L-S. We'll go for that. Abundant terrestrial carnivore. Abundant. I don't know. Two down. Two. Sorry. Down. Two. This could be so many things. Although I can't think of any things it could be. 
uh, right now. Pack animal. Wolf? Wolf? Oh, no, look, because the L's there. I thought I'd got it then because I was excited because of the L. Um, what other animals are in packs? Loads. This might not even be gulls. Sugar coating. What's the, is there another name for sugar coating? Uh, I don't know. Something Tuesday, Mardi Gras. Mm, don't know. Driver's license and others. ID? IDs? IDs. Could this just be as simple as IDs? Ah, uh, we're never going to get a lead member of a COVID-19 task force, are we? I mean, I might remember them if, if, if they said some crazy shit in the White House um, daily briefings. I might remember them. Pungent. Uh, so, what, so if something's pungent, it's a bit shit because that, that's, a, that's a word that I relate to smelling and I can't smell. So if I don't get this, that's probably why because I'm feeling really uh, emotional. Law Enforcement Agency. FBI. Um, let's look at some of these two down sorry one down is two so if that was FBI two two nah pack animal mm, could this be bison bison are in packs are they I don't fucking know and then this isn't gulls so what would this be if that was bison God, we go. God, I've only got 30 seconds left. I'm not doing it. Sugar coating. I don't know. If you sugarcoat something, then you're making it, if it, you're literally coating it in sugar or you're making it sound better or appear better than it actually is. Is this FBI? What other law enforcement agencies are there? I've got 10 seconds. I'm actually just going to quit. I don't throw in the towel regularly, but I'm throwing it in there right now. I've only got five seconds left. I quit. I quit. Pay out. I quit. I just quit. <sighs> Shell IDS. Okay, so IDs, IDs, right, okay, 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 okay. Uh, FBI or CIA? CIA, okay, we don't know. We don't know yet, do we? Glaze, what did you have glaze for? Sugar coating. Mm, icing, icing. Sugar coating, okay, so it's not gulls. Fucking... Uh, what other animals? Shorebirds? Oh, I don't know. DEA, it could have been Fluffer. Um, wow, loads. Of, you, there's not many answers coming through here. Turns? Shorebirds, turns. With a U or an E? E. Well, I've never heard of that before. Should we look? At, should we have a look at them? And I'm going to be exclusively positive. Cool. Good job. Turns. So what's one down? Two. Two faced. Two faced. And then did somebody say dog? Eight, eight across. Abundant terrestrial carnivore. Oh, uh, Acrid. Six across. Okay, acrid. Uh, so what's two down? Pack animal. Oh, Fauci. Yes, I do remember that person. I do remember, or at least I, re I remember the name. Uh, there you go. I didn't get it, but we got it together. And actually, that's probably more satisfying, unless you bet that I was going to get it, in which case, um, sorry.
Browser is still muted. Thank you. That's a good shout. You didn't get the music. Okay. Anyway, my, I've I've now gone into this Discord server and I've changed my notifications, so I only get a notification if I if somebody ats me. So does that mean I don't get the beeps? Uh, I don't know. I don't know. It's a burrow donkey. So what was that? Pack animal. Never would have got that either. Let's have a look. B burrow. Oh, it's Spanish for donkey. So we're just adding some Spanish now. That's fair, isn't it? Get a lot of Spanish speaking people over there. Um, there we go. Should we go old school and do a property guesser? I'm in no mad rush to jump into the snooker. I thought I was going to do more admin today. I thought I was going to do like two to three hours just going through each channel on Discord and explaining the ins and outs of Discords and what they mean and what they can provide to a, a, a community and uh, maybe go through the, the Wikipedia of Discord and how it began. But we don't have to. We'll do Property Guesser instead. Hello, Daitai Fighter. Daitai, you can now recommend that game that you recommended to me earlier on on WhatsApp um, in Discord. There you go. There are the details. Um, VT, thank you very much for your question. Favourite Crankwave album? I'm still not really sure what that means. Let's find out. I mean, I know I just Googled it. Crank. Let's find... Did I just get a little alert again then? Let me, there we go, because I've got it open on the web. Crankwave artists. Um, if you're not sure what this, what I'm on about this, uh, Crankwave was one of my biggest um, artists that I listened to on Spotify this year, apparently. Idols, Fontaine's DC. Okay, I did listen to a lot of this. I listened to the Black Country New Road album. I wasn't that fast. I listened. I've sort of gone off idols a bit. Uh, I've sort of gone off idols a little bit because what's the name of their new album? Tank, but with a it's spelt like T A N G K. But no, what's the other thing? Anyway, there's just a couple of things that. Yeah, I really like the music for the new Idol song. Um, I've just gone off a little bit of the uh, the lyrical content a little bit, but fucking amazing live, like some of the best gigs I've ever been to. Anyway, uh, so yeah, I definitely did listen to Idols a fair bit this year. Parquet Courts was one of my um, one of Tom's, my old friend Tom's best like favorite bands. So yeah, so in terms of what my favorite album is. I did. I tried Yard Act, but I couldn't. I just couldn't. And then the Murder Capital were big this year as well. I listened to that album quite a lot. I don't know. I don't fucking know. Thanks so much for your question, VT Experiments. Squid are from Brighton. Are they? Uncle and me are going to be going to um, uh, the Great Escape Festival again in Brighton it was so fun last year and actually a few like um, Teen Jesus and the Gene Teasers were in my top artists in fact they were my number one top artist on Spotify because they've become a favourite in the house because I really like seeing them uh, they're like an Australian all girl band um, uh, and I really enjoyed seeing them in Brighton and the Great Escape and then they're good for like my daughter even though they're swearing there's a few fucks and there's one bitch. And uh, yeah, but uh, Hannah and Alex both really like them. So we play that a lot in the car. Property guesser, where should we go? Um, I'll tell you what, let's make this interactive. Who was the last person to slide into the server? According to Discord, I wouldn't use that phrasing. Fluffy. Hello, Estra. Fluffy Pink Blonde, where do you want to go? Where should we go? 
if you're there, if you're listening. Oh, you like parquet courts as well, don't you, Funkle? I forgot about that. Oh, fuck, says Fluffy. Oh, fuck. Bridgewater. Where's Bridgewater? Is that Kent? Discord. If you do exclamation mark Discord, there you go. Click on that and it should just automatically invite you in or you automatically join. Sort of Glastow y. Where's Glastonbury again? Down here ish. Well, okay. Sorry, let's make this easier. Uh, Exeter, Plymouth, Bath, Bristol. These are your choices. <laughs> I've been to Glastonbury, but I can't. I, I paid no attention when I was going there. Bristol, there you go. Okay, so what we're going to do is look at a house. We're going to try and guess how much it is, but that part of the game we forget most of the time. We're mostly going to judge the interiors and do a little gamble on the garden situation. Keith, make stuff. There you go. Die Tie Fighter doxed. Uh, well, just by me. I didn't even need to say that. Um, but yeah, there's a game suggestions thing there. So you can post that game in there and then other people might share their experiences like in a community. The gamble is going to be whether or not this has uh, any grass in the garden. Will it have a garden at all? Capriso's not sure. Let me find the bet. Here we go. What grass will they have in the back garden? Two minutes. Go, 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 go. Real fake or um, no grass at all. In the meantime, let's find out where it is. I've never been to Bristol. French A. I I want to live in French A. Totterdown. Great names. Henleys. All right, so we're slightly out of the town centre. The city centre, sorry, no disrespect. We've got a couple of people in the chat from Bristol, I believe, or who have recently moved there. Close to your brother's house. Sheep, sheep still bitter. Anyway, so this is where we're heading. Uh, let's look at some info. We've got a... Dining room, a lounge, and a kitchen. This is a classic sort of Victorian terrace. I'd like, I, I used to want to live in one of these. They're massive, like, thick walls. Um, upstairs, two beds, and a bathroom. And then you can go up some more stairs to another converted bedroom. So that's pretty exciting. Should we look at the info? Just and see if it says anything about garden. It does. It does say something about garden. So I'm going to wait before I show you this. I can read some stuff to you. Can I hide this? I can't hide this. Let's just close it for a second and we'll look at it. I mean, well, no, it doesn't actually confirm anything. It just confirms that there is a garden. There is a garden. And it's south facing. There's seven seconds left. I don't know if that reveals anything. Hello, Matt. How are you? Uh, here we go. Beautiful condition. That's exciting. Lovely quiet road. Three floors. Three double beds. Huge loft room. That's going to be nice. Bright and sunny. Yes. Wood flooring. Excited about that. Clean burn log burner. What does that mean? No smoke will get into the house. Uh, ornate Victorian coving. South facing garden. Chain free. I'm excited. It's going to be fancy and it's going to be really pricey. Yeah. Uh, is there anything else we need to know? No. Let's go. What does the bet say? Chain free means that you don't have to, there's not like a chain of buyers and sellers. So if you were in a situation, so basically if you're ready to buy this house, you're not going to have to wait for the people who own the house to then buy a house. 
I've never been involved in that kind of thing, but I, I imagine it's fucking annoying. Well, I know it is. I've heard loads of people talk about chains and how annoying they are. Uh, what am I doing? I was going to look at the prediction. 62% of the pats have gone on fake, 29 real, 10 no grass at all. Is that a UK thing? Uh... I don't think it's you. Maybe the like calling it a uh, chain is a UK thing, but I don't know what you'd call it in the US. Yeah, yeah, Domella. Do you call? Do you know what that might be? Who knows? See you later, Dai Tai. Um, let's have a look in the house. It's going to be nice. Oh, it's going to be orange. Why so orange? They've even filled the fruit bowl with oranges. Let's have a bit of contrast. I thought this was going to be great. They've got a whiteboard. Oh, I've got a whiteboard, but that's because I'm in an office. It is like an... Oh. It's the, it's the mixture of the colour of the paint, the, all the pine furniture, and sunlight. Get rid of one of those things. Black out all the windows so you never get any natural light. Paint the window, paint the walls, or um, mix up your furniture a bit. Anyway, you've got a little office area over here. Is this a picture of a cat? Shelving. Shelving? Shelving. Some baskets. Got some baskets over here. The whiteboard, I'd love to be able to know more about what's happening on here. I'm, sadly, I don't think we can enhance this. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Jeffrey, Miranda, Pickles. Pickles the cat. Pickles has got the vet on the Monday. And then no plans. Doll's house. So maybe there's a child actually. <laughs> do you want a pickles life capriso because pickles was actually going into the vet to have his little cat penis chopped off balls they chop the balls off don't they not the penis <laughs> uh, I don't think you want that if we had a similar board in my house, it would just have it all scribbled out and YOLO ADHD written all over it. <laughs> that is good. Pip saw my whiteboard the other day. Didn't comment on it, but I saw him have a little look and I think he respected it. I think it was a look of respect. Um, let's move on. Okay. The, the classic galley kitchen. Uh, it's nice enough, isn't it? It looks like a nice... Oven. I think everything's fine in here. Everything's fine. Got a lot of spices, some sauces. Nice surface space. You've got some nice tiles. Uh, we've got a, a washing machine and a dishwasher and a dryer and an oven. The good thing about this picture is you can see exactly what's in this kitchen and what you could fit in the kitchen. Because once they've moved all these little uh, extra white goods away, you know you can get a kettle over there. You know you can get a microwave toaster and deep fat fryer, rice cooker. Didn't comment on it to me. <sighs> can see the grass. Can't see any. Sorry, I've read that as can see the grass. You can't see any grass. Free coli. That's a real a bread maker. That makes sense. That's true. We can see full patio there, but the garden might go around to the side. No biscuits, no joke. Um, I I started write, writing down some tw ideas for Twitch, which I'm going to move on to the whiteboard for next year. Uh, and one of them is like merch question mark because I'm not that committed to doing anything like that because I don't think there's really a demand. But then I did write Scotty Two Potty Hotty Potty, which is not as fun to write as it is to say. Anyway, here's the kitchen. 
it's fine. Functional. Oh, have we got Astro? Who went high on Astro? Who knew? Is this an inside job? Did somebody know? That's fake grass. That's fake grass. Did we have one big bet? Blake Town. Somebody pumped 50k into AstroTurf. I mean, really? If you wanted... No, I'm not even going to suggest that you could cheat because we're, everything that we do here is with... We just believe is done with goodwill. Do we know for sure there's no grass? But 50k, that's suspicious betting, isn't it, Llama? It is. It's a big old bet. I think we might need an inquiry. You're going to pull, be pulled in front of a uh, independent inquiry here, whoever it was. What about the Jamiroquai mouse map? Maybe I could actually get those produced, Elbow. That's a good idea. Well, it is kind of pointless, but it is uh, that's definitely not real grass. I think we can agree it's AstroTurf. But you know what? I'm not going to pay out just in case this garden um, stretches round. Fluffer, how much did you bet? Was it a lot? It does mean we can do a cut chair bet. This is fantastic news. It's if. We're going to wait and just see. That's a big old, oh no, 2,500 is not too bad. Right, we've got so many photos left. Hopefully another picture of the garden and not a bedroom. In fact, let me check just in case for the cut chair. No, we're back into the house. Okay, I'm going to pay out. I, I think I'm safe to pay out. I'm not going to regret this. Complete, fake, enjoy your pats. I hope this is all fine. That's a lot of pats, isn't it? 100k to Stuzef. Stuzef, have you already in the best mates video? Oh no, that's to Stuzef and two others. Wow. Hello to Rancho Lansbury. Looks similar to one of my old uni houses. The students before us made the garden into a beach. Basically just build a sand every... Oh God, that's such a student thing to do. Seems like such a good idea. Have one amazing party and everyone's in Bermuda shorts and uh, drinking cocktails and then it rains and everyone's putting their f cigarettes out uh, in the sand and it's just horrid. Um, let's go. We've got another angle of this horrid coloured room. Cat shitting everywhere, yeah. Sand throughout the house. Sand's gross. It's a bit like snow. Like, sand's so nice initially. Obviously, if you're on a beach, then it's a different story. But when snow, like, lingers for a few days and it gets muddy. and Oh, this, little, this is a little IKEA kitchen. We had one of these when Alex was, was little. Classic. Um, like the floor. Like the natural floor. Are we going to expand? We've got loads of pictures to get through. It doesn't tell us much, does it? I think there's a child here. Uh, this, is this better quality to see what they've got on during the week? Imagine having the whiteboard massive like that in the main room. Joseph, what did you say? Just then? Or is there an older comment? I'd never knowingly bet on fake grass. What does that mean? Joseph, full disclosure, this was a bodged bet that has come up good. I thought I was betting on no grass. <gasps> I think that's a ban. I think that might be a ban for Joseph, which is a real shame. 16-month subscriber. Oh, dear. What a shame. Please do not ban Stuzif. Just yet. That's unbelievable though. Amazing. Okay. 
that's quite good actually because we were all suspicious and now if you're going to do something suspicious you can just afterwards if people go that's suspicious you just go oh i didn't mean to do that it gets you off can't have stews points uh oh pod bible little pod bible message little pod bible message mark that as unread for later on um right here's the here's the house let's let's carry on are we still we're we in the right scene we are missed what you said about was said about the beach garden the kitchen was a fucking state about 80 percent of the time yeah tarantula we were talking about sand everywhere cat shitting cigarettes being put out in in uh in the sand it's miserable Cuck chair vote. Let's get on the cuck chair vote. Remember, if you've been here for a cuck chair vote before, I cannot write cuck in a prediction, but I can write cock. I think that's what I'll do, because in the last one, I think I changed it to... Oh, no, I did. I just wrote cock. So the question here is, in the main bedroom, will there be a, a cuck chair? A chair that is sort of aiming at the bed. It's not a chair tucked into a... Um, dressing table it's not a gaming chair it's not a, any other kind of chair it's a chair that is just in the room and is aiming at the bed shall i change it to the kavak will there be a cup chair in the main bedroom one minute one minute Oi! thank you mario i was about to do that so quick um, hello Rotten Pie again in the Discord sorry I was thought there were loads of other people who joined but it was actually lots of people saying hello to people which is really nice and to the all the other people who have joined and aren't best mates don't worry your time will come it's going to be incredible and to Fluffernutter and Fluffernutter's alter ego What's going on? Mod team are on it. Mod love. The mods are the best, aren't they? Best mods. I nearly gave Guzbo his own category in the Discord as emergency mod, but um decided against it because I couldn't be bothered to set up the permissions, even though I could probably copy. Anyway, the bet has been made. 55% say yes to the cuck chair. 45 say no. Let's see how we get on. Into the living room. Oh, we've got another like blanket color. Deep red. Oh. Leather seats or faux leather. Nice little wood burner there. Little rug. Softer on the knees when you're stoking at the fire or making love in front of the fire a bit close actually that's a bit close for making love isn't it uh, and I know you might go oh don't say making love that sounds gross you could I think you can only make love in front of fires you can't um, you can't fuck because it gets too hot not the best TV situation but we'll take it um, light on and daylight Lama won't be happy with that. These people have too much money. What? Why? What's made you say that from this room? Cut chair in the lounge. That is a bit, isn't it? Because it's true. You're not seeing the telly from there. Just a vibe. I imagine this paint was quite expensive. Although... This is a classic, like, light, the, like, the paper light shade is a classic, like, my first flat or I'm a student kind of light shade. Every, it's a rite of passage that most people have this kind of light shade at some point. And you think if they had a lot of money, they might have something a bit more fancy. Let's move on. Another angle. Now it looks weird having the natural light and the and the light on but we're not learning anything from this except for the size of the room nice doors nice old doors is this a picture of no this is two people okay i thought that was cat ears but it's human heads very naughty's paint job 
it is. I don't think I'd ever pick this color. Hallway. Classic hallway. I really, I like the size of that mat. That's a good size mat. You're not dragging any dirt or wet feet onto the, onto the wooden floors there. That's great. And I like the floors. Bannisters are nice. Wonderful. Let's close some of this. Hold on. Another angle of this room, totally unnecessary. Apples and satsumas. This is actually how I'd say most fruit bowls end up. Our fruit bowl right now in our kitchen is like this. The apples and the satsumas, or whatever mini oranges you've gone for, always remaining. Bananas go fast first. If we get any other like slightly different fruit, they go and you're just left with the apples and the satsumas. Look how my Halloween one's going, by the way. Should just chuck that, shouldn't I? Okay, on to the next. Oh, it's a, we've seen this a lot, haven't we, in Property Guesser, where you get people who are like, a different color for every room. And is that a cut chair? We don't know that this is the master bedroom, but fucking hell. I think it is. That is such a cuck chair, isn't it? Have we ever seen a more cuck chair than that? That's the most cuck chair I've ever seen, David. I agree. Usually you get a little bit of a jaunty angle. So it's a case of, hmm, am I looking? That is intense right in the middle of the bed. So you're really getting a good angle. It's in the way as well. Like this little area here is for getting around the bed. That's in the way. Put it over here. It's a blatant cut chair. It's one of the most blatant cut chairs we've seen. You could be sitting there and if, the, if, if what was happening in the bed was happening under the covers, you could lift the covers. You could still be sat down and get your head under the covers. Maybe make a little spooky sound. Or just blow on one of their feet. One of their feet? Foots. Blow on one of their feet. Blow on their feet. That's it. But I didn't want to say all of, I don't want you to think I'm saying all of their feet. Just one of their select, one of their two, just one of their feet. Hello, Brat. Good morning. Uh, we found a cut chair in this house, Brat. We're very excited. Look at the colorings, though. We're excited about the chair, but look at the colorings. Look at this, like, deep. Like the purple and the... like It's like wine, like a red... And then you've got... What's this? Like Rupert the Bear's trousers color. And then what's this? It's not even a mint green. And then the pine mustard... Yes, brat. <laughs> well, brat, we do um, these quite a lot now, property guesses, and one of the things that we do is we gamble on whether or not there's going to be a cuck chair in the bedroom. And I think 55% said yes today. We don't know if this is the main bedroom, though. The gamble's on the main bedroom. It doesn't look like there's much in here for it to be a main bedroom. You'd think there'd be some more trinkets or some stuff or some chargers. So this could be the spare. There is a wardrobe, but it looks like it might just have pillows in it and stuff like that. The colours are not good, are they? Is it a cuck if they can touch? Good point, Sparkle Muffin. I've got too excited there. I think if you lift up the covers and you blow on their feet, that's not, you're not touching, are you? Yeah, you can't hide in there. A lot of... Um, Ikea like furniture or maybe Argosy type furniture here. Anyway, let's go. Let's see if this was the main bedroom. It's a cuck chair, but I don't want to pay out just in case we suddenly see a bigger bedroom. But I think this is the master bedroom. I just don't want to confirm just yet. Oh, hello. We've got a musician. I'm into this window. Is this a little bathroom window? A little tight. Imagine. 
somebody's having a shit and you just climb up, you just climb up the, uh, the bookshelf just to have a little peek through. <laughs> and then the person notices you and you fall and the, and the, the bookshelf collapses. The guitar strings all break and you fall down the stairs. What is this window? I think that is going to be the bathroom. Look, at this. it's not a very deep room. Or is that the bathroom there, actually? I think you're probably right, actually. I think that's the bathroom there. Anyway, let's find out. Let's keep moving. Out here, yellow. Very yellow. We've got a crank wave musician. Here's the blue room for the, for the kids. Two, two kids. Or maybe the kid has a friend over occasionally. Very, quite sparse, but that's okay. Some nice cuddly toys. A very small shelf. There's not much we can say about this. You appreciate the change of colours per room? I d yeah. It's not very economical when it comes to paint, though, is it? And the pictures are very tiny. Is this some sort of... What's this scary... Is that, is that a black and white picture of Barney the Dinosaur? Or like a gingerbread man. What is this? It's black and white though. It looks a bit spooky. A snowman. Could be a snowman. I like these guys though. Can we agree on that? I don't think there's anybody who doesn't like these guys. I can totally imagine what they'd be like to, to snuggle up with. Squishmallows. Wow, okay. I think Alex has got something like this, but a bit smaller. They look, these are big. Those are very, very big. Okay, we're not even halfway through the pictures yet, guys. I think that was the master bedroom, but we're just going to wait. We're just going to wait. A uh, little, little toilet. Not much to say here. Another, another different colour of paint. Some more natural wood again. Natural wood and different colour paint. We're getting a lot of that. Oh, okay. There's a... No. That's just a chair in the bathroom. Oh, look at the colour of the tray, the shower tray. Heated tower rails is good. I would like that. Look at that, the discoloration there. Do you think that was white when it was first installed? Cuck bath. Very narrow door. There's just some piping through there, surely. Sorry, why are we getting Discord alerts again? It's all right if we get one every so often. Lee, why would you need a chair in the bathroom? Yeah, probably accessibility. But... Um, You got yeah, you got your scales underneath. For example, they clearly have kids, and if you have ever have to bath kids, then you're spending quite a lot of time in an uncomfortable position. So actually, having a chair would be great. And luckily, they got the space for that. Let's move on. There's carpet. There's carpet in the bathroom. There's carpet in the bathroom. Tiny pictures again. Tiny little pictures with coloured frames. Um, carpet in the bathroom. Although quite nice though. The, the, the first couple of steps with slightly damp feet get dried off on that bit of carpet and then you're away. You're away into the rest of the house. Ah, into the yellow hallway. It was for just dull photos from holiday. Just, just dull landscapes. Very smeary light switch there. Is that very smeary or is it patterned? Give the little light switches. That's often neglected when it comes to household cleaning. The light switches, you're touching them every day. Twice a day usually. Very smeary. You thought it was another tiny picture. <laughs> uh... Oh, is this the master bedroom, guys? 
Or is this another child's bedroom? Or is this a spare room? What is this? I forgot about the, the, the room upstairs. I'm still willing to pay out on the... <gasps> There's a chair. Is it a sofa? Oh my God. Yeah, the globe makes me think that it's not an adult's bedroom. By the time you reach adulthood, you've lost all wonder when it comes to the, to the world and the globe and the fact that we live on a, on a, in a globe, on a globe. And to be honest with you, when you become an adult, you start to understand that maybe there are one or two other theories out there. Maybe the world isn't actually that shaped. But kids can't actually grasp that uh, just yet. So they get excited about a spinny ball. Another tiny picture of, I mean, it's kind of centered here. It's centered, it's centered, it's the bed that's the problem. That's awkward though, isn't it? Because of this column. We do have a little bit of AstroTurf here. You have the same rug, you like to hoover lines into it like a fancy lawn. That's great. I hate hoovering lug, uh, rugs because quite often they end up sucking up. Like you get a little corner of it up the sofa, up the sofa, up the hoover, which is uh, which is annoying. Um, yeah, I don't think this is the master bedroom because again, there's just not enough signs of. Although we got some books here, I think this is a kid's bedroom. Although, why has the kid got the fucking amazing bedroom? Maybe the parents have done so much cucking in that main room that they do not want any child of theirs to spend any time in that bedroom. Hello, B. Hoovering lines means doing cocaine, right? Just want to make sure my UK slang is current. Uh, yeah. Welcome in, B. Dolan. I'm gutted I'm going to miss your stream later because it's one I've been really looking forward to. Um, today, B. Dolan... Is this happening, B? Before I promote it and you say, actually, I can't do it. Um, is doing uh, the remix competition stream. If you haven't seen this before, I've only seen one. It was really, really cool where B has provided, um, what is it? The acapella version of one of his tracks and got people to make remixes and stuff like that. This time round, he's provided um, audio from the... Uh, support they had on the UK tour Mathago Craze amazing spoken word artist and people have been making amazing stuff and tonight on B's stream he's going to be going through and listening to them and there's a great mix of people there's like amazing producers musicians who do this stuff all the time some might even do it for a living and then there's hobbyists and there's people from our community, Funkle, Booch, maybe Blaketown, Mythago. Did I say Mythago again? Uh, and uh, I'm really excited because I listen to Funkles and I fucking love it. I haven't listened to any of the others, but I listened to Funkles and I messaged and I was like, fuck, it's really good. And I don't just have to tell you that. Um, but that's happening later. And it means not only do you get to hear people's musical talents, but you get to hear... Uh, some very, very impressive um, spoken word pieces, which will hit hard. And I'm sure uh, B will do all the appropriate trigger warnings before it happens. Anyway, let's go back to this and cut chairs and cocaine rugs. Is that a cuck sofa? That's like a sofa bed, isn't it? I think this is a kid's bedroom. It's, such a, it's so weird, though. There's like nothing that really tells you anything about the people that are in this house. Yes, elbow. Tune in. Mythago. Is that happening? I think that's happening at 7 p.m. UK time. <gasps> What's this? We've got a little table and chairs in the corner. I reckon that's their old dining room table until they upgraded. I like, I mean, the, it's been nicely, um, I need to mute. I'm just going to close Discord, actually. It's been nicely converted, right? I like the, um, the skylights or those, those windows, whatever you call them. Yeah, it's really weird, isn't it? Oh, you think it might be eight? I wonder if I can get home quick 
we've got a table book for eight o'clock for this thing tonight. Maybe I'll just try and get home by 10 or something and then I can, I sh or then the stream should still be going. We will see. This is a massive room. There's some stairs up to it. Here's the kitchen again for anybody that missed it. Here's the garden. We paid out on AstroTurf. Stuzif won loads of, loads of points even though it was an accidental bet, which is incredible. Uh, but most importantly, it's a nice house. Even though we're not really big fans of what's going on inside, you might have to do some... You're going to want to do some work. You're definitely going to want to do a lot of painting. Look at this for an example of a cut chair B. Anyone else that's just come in. We're going to pay out. We're going to pay out on this being the master bedroom and there being a cut chair in the main bedroom. Look at that. Incredible. Centered. There's no, there's no doubt. There's no doubt what that chair's all about and what it's for. Anybody else, I believe, would put it here. Would put it. You've got a bit more space there and you're not going to... The amount of times this person gets out of bed, go for a wee and then stubs their toe, their little toe on one of these chair legs. Vivian, shall we move the cuck chair? No, that's where Roger sits. That's... But your toes. Your gross toes. Choose outcome. Will there be a cuck chair in the main bedroom? Yes. Yes. Paid out. Get the smells. Urgh. Does look like a floating bed. Does seem like an Airbnb. It does. Or they took all the photos and they realised, shit, we didn't, we didn't mean to have all our family photos on show like this. Has anybody got Photoshop? Can you just make all the pictures really small? And actually, it's just somebody's Photoshop these and these are actually normal size pictures everywhere. I mean, that's a clock, isn't it? Look at this. Can we see the uh, estate agent? They've used a flash. Can we get a little shot of the... Uh... I thought I'd shut down Discord, but I haven't done it in my uh, little taskbar. Quit. Reminder, if you are late or new or whatever it may be, there you go. Mary's done it. I've got a Discord now. You're welcome to join it. There's lots of lovely places to chat, but whatever. Don't have to. Um, how much do we think this house is worth? It is in Bristol. It is a three bed. There's no chain. Uh, and this is the floor plan. We've got an extension or a um, conversion at the top. 315-335-275. BP, get in the Discord. 385. Is anybody going to do 420? 365 and, and 420 usually come up at some point. Thank you, Lana. Uh, thank you, VT. 340. What's the average here? Three. I think I'm going to go 385 with Prox. Also, Prox is back. Prox hasn't been around in the chat much, but it's continued to sub for the whole fucking time. Uh, we're going to go with Prox. 385. I feel like that's a decent average as well. Here we go. Shitting hell. Did anyone? Matt, Matt, you got close there. 420 was pretty close in the end, guys. Matt got the closest. Matt, but less common. Ridiculous country. Dear, oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Right, it's 20 to 3. I need to leave here at 4. Oh, shit. Let's just check my email and check that the school club hasn't... Okay, we're good. <gasps> there is a message from school. Okay, it's not to say that girls' football has been cancelled. Okay, we're good. We can keep streaming. 
Uh, it was 425, Domella. 425 grand. Can you believe it? Sorry, big stretch. Oh. Right, let's go old school. Let's do something we haven't done for ages. I think he's losing 3-0 in the semi-final of the World Championships. If you've been here for the rust and you've been like, why is Ad not great at games? You just fucking wait. Because I'm about to play snooker. I'm really sorry. It's a really loud game when the intro music plays. We're going to play snooker. <laughs> oh, big stretch. You've got a bloody Zoom course at three, just want to stay in a blanket. If it's on Zoom, Bolt BP, surely you can stay in the blanket. You can, if, you can make it look like a shawl. Like a fancy shawl. Get your hotty botty. I'll never delete that video. Lama, if you think about all the times I'm going to play this game on stream, we, I've, I've played this 98% of the time I'm going to play it. There's no point deleting the video now. Um, oh, I don't like snooker though. Don't worry. Really, this game is here for a... It's a conduit for great chat and uh, good times. So definitely keep sticking around because we can discuss everything. It's very chill. Hello, Wolsey. Thank you very much for your question. Would you rather piss snooker balls or shit snooker cues? <laughs> oh, that is good. That is really good. Uh, would you rather piss snooker balls or shit snooker cues? Wow. I actually think shitting a snooker cue would be really satisfying. Um... As long as you weren't aware of the feeling of having a snooker cue inside you before. Definitely that. Whereas pissing snooker balls. Is that what like bladder stones is like? Uh, it would be awful. There's nothing good about that. Nothing. I'd like to... Um, Big end last. Yeah, ease it out. Like most shits, Ada, Ada Soros. T too much shit chat. Thanks, Wolves. Thanks for your question. <sighs> right. The sound. Imagine though, actually, Tarantula Lansbury, that's another good point. If you were to urinate and snooker balls came out and you were um, standing up to urinate, that's br you're breaking toilets and, you and urinals all over the country, all over the world. Porcelain cannot take that. Mind you, how would a toilet deal with a snooker cue? Walls asks some really good questions. Snooker. I'm Scotty Two Potty. Let's play the video again, just in case people didn't see it. Turn it up! That was interesting. Turn it up! Turn it up! Turn it up! Scotty Two Potty Hotty Botty coming soon. Oh, I know that I... Oh, no, we have got audio. Okay, so... This is him. I've won 21 games out of 34. That's actually not too bad, but look at that. Look at that match. Look at look what I'm doing there. One, two, three, four, five, six. I beat Stephen Maguire in the first round of the World Championships. I beat Luca Brussel, Luca Brussel in the second round. And I'm currently in the semi against Barry Hawkins. And I'm 3-0 down. Look, I'm 3-0 down. I have not won anything. Or if I have, it's been like a weird league thing. Maybe I, I can't really remember what happened there. I'm 70th in the world and I'm retiring from snooker after this tournament. I'm 3-0 down in a best of nine. I'm usually quite good at this, but I'm 3-0 down. Let's get some bets. I'm going to sneeze.
What a rush. Sneezing is just... Do you ever sneeze and just be like... Why? Like, why? Let's just do the bet. Let's not, let's not talk about sneezing too much. Um, what a rush. I don't have a bet for this. Okay, we'll... Will, Will add win this frame. So it's not the whole match, it's this frame. We're going to do a one minute bet. That's not a long time to do your bets. So get your bets done quick. Start prediction. Tell us, tell me about sneezing. Tell me what you think. Men's loser minging. They mostly are, yeah. Especially in like bars and clubs and stuff. Just piss everywhere. Terrible. I find that hard to believe but um, 20 seconds to get your bet in I'm going to make my break because it's not really well actually I suppose it would affect things can I remember how to play this that's the question 3-0 down should I put music on I haven't I never usually do uh, here we go the occasional sneeze is good it's just a really crazy thing. Do you remember as a kid? That's a shit break. Do you remember as a kid, like, being told that you can never sneeze with your eyes open and then trying to, but it's it's just not possible. You can. Prove it. Is snooker happening right now in real life? How do, Llama, can you prove this? Can you go and get some pepper and put it up your nose and make a little video? Right, I'm going to speed through this. You can't, your eyes will pop out. Exactly. Why does it sound... Is the sound weird? It sounds like we're in a really echoey room. It's quiet, isn't it? It's quite quiet, the game. Very quiet. It sounds really... It's not muted. I don't think it's muted. You heard the video. Did you hear the video sound when it went really loud, when the game started? I actually hate the muted emote. I've realised that I'm going to come to hate that. Okay, well, it's really quiet. Here we go. Here we go. This is where it all begins. For Scotty Two Potty. It is really quiet. Oop, don't concede. Ah, what? So you could hear a... Oh, I don't know. I could hear some stuff. Here we go. Now, now we're going to hear it. Also, I just turned... I've turned it up quite a lot, so let me turn it down again. I turned it... No, I actually had the game open when I first started the stream, and then I was like, actually, no, let's, I don't know when I'm going to start playing, so I closed it again. And I thought I'd have to adjust those volumes again, but anyway. I think he's playing this with a lot of power. You can hear that now, yeah? Let me know if it's too quiet or loud. It's a bit muffled for me, but that's because my headphones are going through a hat. Eight. Full disclosure, my eyelids don't stay like wide open, but I can stop them from closing. Imagine most people could if they tried. I remember trying quite a lot as a kid. I'd love to do like a blow by like a real super slow mo analysis of a llama sneeze video. I don't imagine it would be very uh, fun for llama though. <laughs> That's fetish content, you fool. Oh. 
Oh, what am I going to do here? Are we going to go for safety? Oh, I hate safety. I think we're going for safety, though. Oof. So I'm assuming a lot of you lot are going to be watching B later. Scott Donaldson, eight. He'll want to get this. Blake Town, have you managed to get your remix done? It's not even a remix, really, is it? There is no existing track. You just have the vocal. I could have done something in GarageBand. That reminds me, guys. That reminds me. I've been reminded of something. If you do join Discord, just in case I, uh, I just want to make sure I actually select my thing. I do already own Orc Massage. It's true. Because um, I think Taff gifted it to me. If you go into music on the Discord, or you can just go into Spotify. Uh, firstly, my World Cup song, I got to do Spotify artists um, unwrapped. My World Cup song has been played by 790 different people. That That is the big crazy thing here I do now walls I do now I've literally I set it up last night um, 790 different people though that's not all Twitch people some people have found this organically and they've all played it twice actually that's a good no we know for a fact that Willow played this about 500 times which is amazing and lots of other people have been uh, been good um Thank you to the fans for 11 people. I'm there in their top 10, 10 artists for three people. I'm in their top five. We know one of those is Willow. I'm not sure how many playlists it's on. I'd have to go and check. But to celebrate the opening of this discord, I've uploaded the Christmas song that I made for a challenge between old work colleagues in 2018 when we all had to make a Christmas song. The music in this is not as good because I made it from scratch in GarageBand and I, I, I don't know how to make music. But Christmas time... is available to listen to. And I also realized it means that I've released a song in 2022 and I've released a song in 2023 and the Eurovision songs we were working on for Wasps Kill Bears' thing are going to come out. Um, it's probably going to be 2024. So then we'll have my lovely uh, Eurovision song, which you can listen to at some point. Get this on your Christmas playlists. And if you want to link to it, you can search it, but it's also in Discord, which you can join. Domela, yes. Les, yes. Walls, yes. Wasps, end of jam. Oh, my song's done. My song's done, I think. I don't know much about mastering. I, I'm sure I could make it sound better, but mastering in um, GarageBand, I don't really get. So I'd like to make the vocals sound a bit different, but I don't really know how to do it. GarageBand stream. I thought about doing that as well, VT, but I just spend a lot of time just like bumbling along with fake lyrics and looking like an absolute idiot. Send me the stems and I'll mix it for you. <sighs> Tempting. You all did great, Llama, Willow. Everybody who listened to that song, thank you so much because that was really fun to have got all those stats through. I still haven't had a check for one penny, maybe one day. Uh... But thank you. Obviously, if you want to support your favorite artists, don't just don't listen to them on on Spotify. Fucking send them money and buy their stuff. So when this hottie, when the Scotty Two Potty Hottie Potty comes out, that's how you support the grassroots. That's how you support the artists. That's where your money can go straight into the artists' pockets. And as an artist, I would really appreciate if you were to buy the Scotty Two Potty Hotty Botty when it comes out because then I'll be able to make future songs about England or Christmas or Europe. <sighs> Can't 
can't wait. In fact, you know what? Uh, merchandise, hot water bottles. Dedicated hot water bottle site with a range of traditional rubber. Yeah, but can I print on there? Custom hot water bottle cover. Okay. This is British made promote. It's British made. I'm clicking on this. It's British made. Superior quality fleece hot. Oh, fleecy. Okay, how much? How much? 50 quid. Brand owners. Individuals may order below at seven pounds. What? Okay, so the setup is 50 quid. No. No. Okay, yeah, are you expecting to have the hottie botty as well as the cover? You are, aren't you? Oh. Uh, ordering and options. Okay, let's say, I mean, what? We're going to sell a thousand? Add to basket. So how much is a thousand? You can't. Seven thousand pounds. Okay, let's start at ten. It's going to be seventy quid, isn't it? So seven seven pounds each, and I sell them. How much would you be willing to pay? That's the setup fee for your. It says seven seven pound per unit. That doesn't seem too bad, right? I honestly think. Ten pounds for a for a Scotty two potty hotty botty is decent. I'm going to speak to B about this because B knows merch. B knows what what sells, and I know B's been getting pretty excited about the, the idea of the uh, Scotty two potty hotty body. I'm I'm. Uh, I, I think I would be willing to buy 10 of these for 70 quid. Oh, that's a big markup. I can't believe you fleece us like this. No, I can, and you should. Um, I think I'd buy 10 of these, and then maybe even I'd just give them away as a prize. Just like, not just yet, because it's Christmas time and I can't just drop 70 quid. No, Llama. You've had cash. You had cash. You won cash just the other day. <laughs> yeah, I'll do a nice design. If it's a Scotty Two Potty Hotty Botty, it's going to be well designed. Don't you worry about it. I know nobody wants them. Then you have to ship them. Mm. I'll be the designer, B. I've just got to find a high res pick of Scotty uh, Scott Donaldson. Do you think I have to tell Scott Donaldson? Maybe I do. Maybe he comes in. No, I don't want him to come in on it. Anyway, sorry Barry. Sorry Barry. I was just thinking about merch ideas. Sorry, Let all the crowds left. Yeah, I'll send one to him. I'll give. I'll definitely give some away. I mean, I. I'll probably give most of them away. We'll see. We'll see. Let's not let's not go into it too much. Uh, I know that's literally all I've been talking about. The Discord. You know I've got a Discord now. Uh, David. I think it was David's idea to do the Scotty Two Potty Hotty Potty. Little safety shot. Oh, he's not hit it hard enough. Scotty's mum would love one. Yes, get in the jump in the Discord, Blake Town. You're more than welcome. Not what he intended at all. That was a bad shot. He'll be annoyed with that. <laughs> He's aiming to sink this into the right corner. Ah, uh, that's a top shot. Lama loves it in the Discord. One. Getting in there, liking everyone's comments. Eight. And you've got to pay a lawyer to screw David out of his shares. Okay, B, whoever your lawyer was the other day who interrupted your streams, put them on to me. Wonderful pot. Nine. 
Let's speed through what Barry Hawkins is doing. I think this is just going to be a big failure and I'm going to lose 5-0 to Barry Hawkins and then never play Snooker 19 again, which means I'm going to have to find another game that I'm actually quite good at. And actually, can I go away from this game saying I'm good at it if I've lost a match 5-0? Barry Hawkins, 20. I know, Daitai Fighter, this is the problem. When you become successful at snooker and you get to the final stages of a tournament and then you're somebody, somebody in the crowd called Horrible David suggests hot water bottles. That's all you can think about. You're not even through to the final yet. You'd sell loads more if you got to the final. Kids up and down the country would be asking for them. He's looking to pot this into the right corner. I am looking to pot it. Yes. And in it goes. John, I would love it if my design got stolen and made into like cheap t-shirts on Redbubble and stuff like that. I think the design is just going to be Scott Donaldson's face. Maybe I'll do some cool like typography that says Scotty Two Potty Hotty Potty. I think that would be good. Like it italicized, like those cheesy eighties t shirts. Okay, let's just go for glory. This is an absolutely crazy thing to attempt. <gasps> Especially when I'm it's not red that I'm trying to pot. Fuck. Um, there's a good point that I need to get these done while it's still cold though as well I'm not getting back on Twitter David's not on Twitter we me and David are going to stay strong and not be on and keep our Twitters deleted miss out on loads of great stuff from our pals this is not easy Close, oh not quite yeah, Dormella, maybe, maybe, maybe. We'll talk about it. Scott Donaldson, one. So, this pot into the right corner. One. Five. I really should. Six. Try and win this match. Eleven. Twelve. Nineteen. Barry Look Hawkins. at the the balls are all over the place. Right. Well, I didn't see how far ahead he is then. I mean, I can see it there. 49 ahead. But how much is left on the table? Polly, are you in? You're always good at telling me that. Now, can he drop this into the right corner? Drop it. Ooh. One. Go here we go here we go here we go. Why am I hitting it so hard? What is, sort of positioning is that? It's a bit. I'm out of practice. Oh, it's okay though. It's okay. I can go for a long straight one. I like a long straight one. Well, it's really not straight. It is long though. Here we go. Are going in. Big one. Magnificent pot. Magnificent. Nine. Um, no rate my lunches today. I think I'm going to do that just on Tuesdays. My lunch today, because I showed you before how healthy I usually try and be for lunch and stuff. Oh no, what do I do now? Um, I'm just going to do this and then kiss it. My lunch today was two fried eggs. Oh, have I snookered myself? No, I haven't. With chips that Hannah, we Hannah went out for work drinks last night. She got home, I can't remember, half nine. She'd bought chips. She'd come home via the chip shop. And so she had half the chips left. And we've got an air fryer recently. 
so I was like, do you know what? I'm going to keep these chips, put them in the fridge, and then I'm going to put them in the air fryer on the reheat mode to see what it's like. And I did that for lunch. So I just had two fried eggs and a load of chippy chips. And it was like they were new chips. They were hot and crispy. It was really good. But it wasn't healthy. Um, I'm just going to hit this really gently. Am I going to do that? Should we just do that? Is this even allowed? Chippy chip sounds... Yeah. Well, I thought she was going to go to the Chinese restaurant to get chips, but I forgot there was actually a, a chip shop near the train station. But yeah, the air fryer. We've been using the air fryer every day since we got it. But the only bad thing is it means our our diet's been slightly, un, well, a fair bit unhealthier because we're like, what else can we do that we'd usually fry? Oh, I just let me pot all the balls. Right. I think I'm going to send... I'm just going to do this. John, how are you? When's your next stream? Have you got a schedule? Have you got any sort of plans? Or are you just doing them as and when? You're affiliate now. I suppose you're getting all your emotes together and stuff like that. The top draw. That should be it. No real way for his opponent to win the frame now. Oh, I think I'm losing the frame now. Four. Six. Mm. Nine. 13. Barry Hawkins, 13. Monday mornings and Friday afternoons. Nice. That's cool. Are we having an affiliate celebration? On Monday. Nice. That's perfect. So you on Monday morning, and then you get Taff, who's like mid morning lunchtime. Looking to pop this into the right corner. Perfect. Five. I should be sticking to Monday nights, Tuesday yeah, and Thursday afternoons moving forward. Okay, I lost that. And the frame, Barry Hawkins. And that is the frame. Well played. Thank you, the fifth frame, Barry Hawkins. Still can't have a moats. You should be able to upload them. It, it might take a little while for them to be approved initially, but you really should be able to add them. Add them. Okay, will I win this frame? If I lose this frame, I'm out of the competition. One minute bet. Can I win five frames in a row? Adam. Oi! Have I got this? Have I got this, Willow? You've backed me. Thank you very much. I am. I'm usually am good at snooks. Should I play it with the mouse? Here we go. 10 seconds left to bet. Do you think I've just lost all, all love and passion for the game? I think, I think that's actually what's happened. Snooker, the snooker times have passed. I'm distracted. I've got a brand new Discord. Don't know if you knew. Loads of messages in there that I haven't checked. That's an excellent opening red. One. Fuck, I can't do my favourite spin. I'm just going to hit really hard. With a lot of power. Mm. I'm not sure what happened there. I reckon I can pop that red. Can I pop that red? So, mm. Oh, 
Okay, fine. We'll just go up the table. I don't like playing snookers against Barry Hawkins. He's really good at safety shots. Let's do this. Is this a crazy shot? Scott Donaldson, eight. Yes, John, you have to do your onboarding. <gasps> Come on, John, you got this. Have you been making emotes? Shall I try and pot this? I am Scotty Two Potty. This is an easy. If I win the world championship, I can put that on the hot water bottle. No, not quite. Pretty close though, but that won't provide. Oh. The quantum of solace. Oh. Got an animated one made. Nice. Yeah, get them submitted it's quick. I think mine took about four days, but it, it, it can it can take a long time. And then if you're lucky, you get to the stage where you get instant approval. Um, he fancies this red. I do fancy this red. Go on. Oh. And he's missed that. I did that once when, um, do you remember when Walls did his, what was it, a birthday stream? Uh, and he got smashed. And I did, uh, I made a real quick emote of Walls. I can't remember what state he was in. And it was instantly approved. And that was fun. Because then I used it in his channel and he couldn't understand. <laughs> no, Walls, this was next level. This was next level. Try and pot this. Definitely pot this. When are you and Lama doing a, a drunk stream again? And what's the game going to be? If you don't know, when we did the snooker tournament earlier on in the year, Lama played Walls in the opening match and uh, they got a bit drunk and a bit filthy. Oh, that's a top shot. Yes, he'll be very pleased with that shot. What can he do here? Yes, John, get your admin done. One of the best dreams of your life. It was good. Will there be a 2024 Twats tournament? I don't think so. I can't imagine a lot of the people who played wanting to sign up again. I could probably get some others, some new people. Uh, never say never. Captain Moobs was the eventual winner, so maybe it'd be nice to get the trophy off him. But um, I feel like the ship has passed a little bit. And maybe another game, though. I might find another sports game. When's Pip going to play tennis again? Oof. Not what he was hoping for. Yeah, I think I'll play another. I'll find another sports game. Maybe not golf, like, I don't know, like a one-on-one -on -one situation. Darts would be good. I, I think Cade was looking into darts games at one point. I don't even, I don't th think there are any, or if there are, they're shit. This is a good snooker game. Racing, yeah, I'd like, I don't know. Maybe we we'll just do Yahoo Pool. Half a chance here. Beautiful pot. Great positional shot. It but yeah, a few of us played some poker last night. That was fun. I don't, that's probably not really a good thing for streaming though, is it? In terms of stream sniping. If you're playing against other people who aren't, you know, who could have the stream open. What was your question? Oh, it was uh, probably not. But maybe, uh, who knows? I reckon, I reckon probably not. It dragged, didn't it? That tournament ended up taking like three months to do. Yeah.
Well, he's looking at potting <coughs> into the right corner pocket. Who was good at poker last night? Shunts, little Shunts. Uh, Lama was decent, and Cade. They were, I think, Shunts and Cade were the ones who won the most hands, and Lama. Did Lama? Did you win in the end? Did you keep playing until there was a winner? I I left before there was a winner. David was good. David left short, shortly after I arrived. Oh, nice Lama. feel left out BP you can play poker with us at some point um, I think there might be like a poker tournament being planned but I think that might be a streamer thing I'm afraid uh, not an easy one but a half chance yeah Twelve. The thing is, unless you're playing for proper stakes, it just I'm, I, this isn't me about to start belittling any wins or anything from last night. I'm just saying, like, going all in just doesn't mean anything when you can just buy back in and it's not real money. So I guess in the real tournament, obviously we're not all going to want to put in loads of money, but maybe it's like you literally just have one buy-in or something, or two, you can buy back in once or... I don't know. We need to make it so it feels like if you lose, then you actually are losing. I'm not on reds. I keep doing this because I don't pay proper attention because I'm thinking about loads of other stuff. Here we go. Pink and the black and not in a not in a good position. Uh Hopefully get down and disturb the Reds a bit, or at least. Would you believe? It? 20 bound. Yeah, I mean, I'd be up for that, but some people might not be. 14. Missed it all happening, but would love to play poker with you all. And yeah, no stakes makes people play different. Yeah, although the bragging rights quite high stakes with this crowd. Also true. Also true. Yeah, it was just, it was in the... Um, in the whole Discord thing that we've got for when we've been doing a lot of planning of games. For people that don't know, there is a Discord for a lot of the streamers who like, plan to play co-op games and stuff together. And Cade suggested it. Get back up the table. And stay up there. Oh. That's a shocker. Because some people came in at different times as well, so people had different numbers of chips, but I think if, if we had a set number of people, it's missed. And we all had the same money, and it was like, this is it. Then it, like playing seriously with everybody would be really fun. And I'm not saying I fucked about the whole time. I was sort of, I was trying to play well, but um, he's looking at this red. Yeah, there's definitely a fair few uh, fuck it type type hands. Uh, I might try and disturb. Oh, it's going to hit that green, isn't it? Let's just see what happens. And the cue ball has finished very nicely. I'm on the black. Am I on the pink as well? Do we get the pink? Maybe we get the pink back. Uh, where is the pink spot? Is it covered? That means the pink would go back there, right? Can that red go in? Maybe we go for the black, which is a crazy shot, but I think well, we do it. Fairly gently. Did anyone watch the K Tempest program last night on BBC Two? I've recorded it. I haven't watched it. 
I'm very excited to watch it. Yes! Wolsey! Yes! What a message to see! Oh, get it filmed. Actually, I don't want to see it. I'll just believe it. <laughs> That's magnificent. This isn't, though. This is not... Uh, and that cone is not too bad, actually, is it? <sighs> Looks so different from different angles. I think that's good. I think we do it. Am I... Am I finding some... He'll be annoyed with that. Of my old form, I was going to say, and then I'm in shit positioning. Oh, dear. Right, get out of the table. Get out of the table. <gasps> Bit harder. Too hard. Too hard. Show me what's happening with the white. Scott Donaldson, nine. Scott Donaldson, nine. Okay. Great shot. That's a really good safety. I'm winning this frame. That's how it looks. Although he's on the safeties and he's very good at them. Come on. Gentle. Gentle, but hard enough to get back up the table, but not too far. I am croaky today. Oh. Now this is building up to be a really interesting test of their safety skills. Oh, uh, I don't like safety skills with Barry. He's far too good at it. He looks like he's trying to get the cue ball tight on the cushion here. I am. So that'll do. Is that... Oh, nearly. Oh, Sparkle Muffin. Did that go in? Did he just pop a ball? <gasps> oh my god. Is that going to go in or is that going to... Is that too tight? You little rotter. I reckon that's going in. Is the pink going in? Let's try it. Not easy. Oh, liquid tennis. One. Why did I just get a Discord alert? And all my Discord is, is closed. I know. Discord. It's closed on my PC. Do I have it open on a website? I do. I've got it open here. Closed. There hasn't been that many, guys. There hasn't been that many. I turned it off streamer mode and I've, I can't work out to turn it back on. I mean, I haven't tried very hard. Well, Snooker. Surprises here with the long pot of Snook it. What a great demonstration of Q power. Eight. Snooped it. Right, if we go a little gentle shot down here, we can get onto this pink. We're building a break. We're building a break. Oh, that's a bad shot, though. Nine. 
Okay, uh, so that would go to the right of the pocket. So that could be right, that could be right. I reckon that's going in. Just fucking hit it. Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? Go, 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 go. It's only the World Championship at stake. Oh, why didn't you spend longer on that? Scott Donaldson, nine. It's fine. Right, I'm going to win this frame now just because Lama's celebrating. No more than half a chance here. <sighs> I've got a little cough. Where's this little cough come from? Got a little cough, Barry. Barry. Seven. Eight. <laughs> yeah. Fourteen. Ah, Wanga. Fourteen. Go, Barry. Okay. Part of me doesn't want to win the frame. I'll be honest. I've just got to be honest. I don't have an elite level sportsman mentality. Nicely onto the black. Nicely onto the black. Nicely onto the black. Here we go. So, do I wish I was playing Rust? Mm, a little bit, Eight. but not really. No, I'm a. I'm so sort of, I am excited about the rust situation, but it has been a weird old wipe. It feels like it's not really worth coming on now until purge. Nine. Yes, John. Do like organizing crates though. Right, I need to do this. Oh, this needs to be precise. Oh, that's nice. No real problem here. Oh dear. Sixteen. Oh, I've, I've got a little cough. Am I gonna have to? Am I gonna have to cancel going out tonight? But then play football. No. Hello, Jivers. Jivers has been talking about you recently with, um, it's been poker chat. A little poker chat. How are you? Hope you're good. I'm on the sem in the semi-final of the World Championships. I haven't played this for a, for a good few weeks. Keep, keep waking up to more shit people have put on my body or in the boxes. Really, B? That's cool. Well, that's nice that people are actually uh, respecting it. Okay, let's have a little knock onto this black and see what kind of... Ca actually, no, let's knock into these reds. That's what we need to do. Disturb these. That's top quality snooker. I'm not really sure what I'm going to do now. Maybe the green. 17. You quit Rust. No, we were playing, um, we're talking about setting up a poker tournament at some point and then there's a few of us who just played a little game on a on a web, on a website, uh, on the World Wide Web. But um, some people want you banned because you're a bit of a pro. I do have long johns for footy or like sports leggings is what I how I like to refer to them as let's go for the green he just needs the green here it's all I need yeah 
sports tights. I actually, I've said this before on stream. I think I love how they feel. It feels amazing. No, because they're made by Nike. And they've got like an elasticated waist. Well, I suppose so do Long Johns. They feel, I really like how they feel. I think compression, like anything that's like, you know, anything that compresses your body. It's natural to like, it's all, it's all, it's all linked to from, from when you were in utero. We all like the feeling of being cuddled. Some people don't actually like cuddles, but maybe they like the feeling of pressure. Weighted blankets, the same thing. There you go, Wolves. I, I don't like the weighted blanket. It's too much. It's too constricting, too heavy. But I don't mind a dressing gown on top of the bed every so often. If it's if it's cold. Tricky pot coming up. Yeah, we've got that, Wolves. That Hannah has got a weighted blanket, and I don't. But Fabulous pot. it means weird. Like every time she rolls over, the weighted blanket moves and like pulls some of the duvet, but then the duvet doesn't move back. So she ends up like a duvet like gobbler and has all of the duvet and then if i want to get it back i need to yank it out from under this really heavy blanket but a lot of people love them she sleeps really well with it two single what's two single beds or two single um, weighted blankets. Two single duvets. It's only a heated heated. No, I don't think I'd want to do that. That's how, that seems weird. But I've never tried it. Have I won the frame? I have. I should just miss this. Well, this is a challenging shot along the cushion. Although I actually need to go in like twenty minutes, so. We're not going to do another frame anyway. Scott Donaldson. I thought you meant two single beds. Frame conceded. Frame Scott Donaldson. Like like some grandparents. And two single beds. Just get to. Hey, I was just thinking. Um, you know that thing with the uh, heated blanket, uh, the weighted blanket. Do you reckon we could just get two fucking single beds? And actually, I'm going to put mine in the other room. I didn't watch the Ronnie Doc, but I heard a bit of. Um, uh, I heard Ian Wright talking about it on Wrighty's House podcast. Bunk beds. I, I used to share bunk beds with my brother and I was on the bottom bunk. He was on the top. He's like eight years older than me. This was quite a long time ago when I was about six. Hated it. Because he used to go to bed later than me. So I'd hear him creaking up into the top bunk really loud. And then I'd wake up and his like arm would be hanging over the edge or his leg would be hanging over the edge and it would freak me out. Um, I won the frame. I won the frame. Well, I'd win the frame. Yes. And that's going to be it because I don't have time to do another frame. It's 4-1. We started the day 3-0 down and I'm still three frames behind. If Barry wins one more frame... That's it. So that means next time I play snooker, hello, Moobs. Moobs, the champ who won the snooker tournament against me. Next time I play snooker, how embarrassing will it be if I just lose one frame and then that's it and I have to retire from snooker? I've really got to get it, give it my all. We've definitely got at least one more snooker stream left. 90k Pats VT, yes! So close, so close to getting in that best mates video. Should I do a little gamble now? I've got like 10 minutes. Can't think of anything. Should I just look at my Discord? What's going on with the bot? Do I need to set the game? Just chatting. It's currently 354,000 people watching Just Chatting streams. 
Yeah, Discord. I've got a new Discord. Thank you for bringing that up, Blake Town. Uh, if anybody wants to join, then please go for it. Um, I'm going to be in there straight after this. In fact, I might just finish up early so I can just spend 20 minutes just in my Discord. Because honestly, it's such a great vibe. Um, if you hate all Discords, then definitely join mine because it's different than all the others for lots of reasons. Um, I'll be back streaming Monday night. Maybe playing Lethal Company with some people I don't know. Um, I don't think it will be Rust. I don't know. Uh, but we'll see. Don't forget, B Dolan stream later tonight. Be there for that one. It's going to be powerful. Uh, and I hope to join that at some point towards the end. Um, I will have been out with a load of... Um... But the Discord thing's not working, is it? None of the, none of the commands are working. I'm going to have to open up Discord now to get that link. Yeah, I think I might daylight because I'm not watching any streams of people playing it before I play it. So if I don't play it on Monday, then it just means not watching loads of my friends streaming. Uh, invite people, copy. Here you go. Here's the Discord. Brand new. Set it up last night. Absolutely brand new. Thank you, everybody, for um, everything. Okay. Have we got new people? No. Jivers. Thank you, Jivers. Um, thank you, guys. I'm going to raid. I'm going to raid G Burb. Haven't raided Burb for ages. It feels like. And I'll see you in people's streams. Probably see you in bees later, like I said. Um, TPI Friday tomorrow night. Do we know if that's happening? Don't know if that's happening or not. GBAB's got loads of people in. Bourbon and Slate are smashing it at the moment. It's amazing. No TPI. Okay. I can't remember what Pip said. Come along with the raid. Let's get my headphones in so I'm ready. <clears throat> thanks, everyone. I'll see you soon. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks for joining the Discord and putting up with the Discord chat. And uh, I'll see you in Discord and other people's Discords. Discord! Exclamation mark Discord. Join my Discord. <laughs>